Welcome back. It is your Feel Good Breakfast Show Expresso on S3. And aside from specializing in skin and body care for over 100 years, Bersdorf has shown its commitment to its purpose, Care Beyond Skin, which is their global sustainability initiative. It expresses Bersdorf's passion to reach beyond its core business of taking care of people's skin and making a sustainable contribution to people, society, and the environment. The first ever Care Beyond Skin Day was aimed at giving 20,000 employees from around the world the opportunity to volunteer for one day to support communities in need. Our very own Kuchle joined in on this incredible initiative. Take a look. I am so excited to be here at Tandam Twalume in KwaZulu Natal to find out more about the partnership between this beautiful community and Biosdorf who have shown their commitment to their Care Beyond Skin Sustainability Initiative and they'll be working together on various improvement projects here at Tanda's Early Childhood Development Centre and in surrounding communities. Tanda offers a holistic response to the critical needs of children in the Mtolumi community. We do this through early childhood education programs, parenting programs, and socioeconomic out of school learning programs. We also offer organic farming programs that enable food security in the household themselves. We can hear the children singing and just having a good time today. Is this what Care Beyond Skin Day is all about? Absolutely. It's really exciting to be here, not just with you, but with all of these kids and with 120 of our staff. Care Beyond Skin Day is really about making impact to the communities that we work with, the communities that we live in. You know, our purpose as a company is to care beyond skin. Mm. Super exciting, I'm, I'm really loving all the, the energy here, people getting excited, teaching them. It's absolutely fantastic. Initiatives like this are very important in South Africa because our democracy is fairly young, right? We are still growing and we don't want anyone to be left behind. For Biosdorf to come in to contribute towards growth and development is something that inspires us as individuals to do what we can to contribute to the greater good of our humanity and our country as a whole. What do you look forward to the most when you arrive here, Tanda? Ooh, a lot, a lot, a lot. Since I'm, um, I'm from this area I was born, I'm in this area, I went to schools around here. So I always reflect on my childhood, you know, how things were like when I was still a child. And I feel so happy um, for, 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 the, for these kids because um, now they're in an environment that is so stimulating. Um, that is also, um, it's also like helping them to have a much better start um, in their lives, which is something that we did not have. So being part of this, uh, uh, there's no price I can put to it, um, actually. Uh, to me, uh, Tanda is at, the, is at you know, a center of my heart. Oh, teaching at Tanda, it's so nice. I learn a lot of things. You know, learning about kids' personalities, kids' behaviors, and understanding, like, the parents, because we are working with the parents, a lot of different people. You learn, like, new skills with them. Once you enter the classroom, you can find that love and you forget about everything. Harrison, what a fantastic day it is. This is absolutely incredible work that you are all doing. Talk to us about why you decided to get involved with Tanda as your CSI project. And we're looking for one that uh, shared our values and also empowered communities in a sustainable and inclusive way. Mm. And Tanda was the perfect partner. And we've been on this uh, journey with them for about seven years. I think we started in 2016. And it's just been amazing to see the kind of impact we've been able to make. I think the kids and just seeing the impact we're making with those kids has been really, really humbling. And how did Tanda utilize the COVID-19 relief fund? Tanda ECD was really the only beacon of hope in lockdown. And we focused on two key areas. One was providing food to a lot of people in the area, the kids as well as elderly people. And the other priority uh, which we had was to make sure that some form of education continued for almost a thousand kids um, of the area. We delivered over 150,000 kilograms, that's 150 tons of food parcels 
to, to the households around the area. The big impact mm. that we made. I truly enjoyed contributing to the painting of the school walls. There were different groups positioned in different places. Some were painting, there was planting, creating wooden garden boxes as well. And also just the interaction with the children, the singing, the dancing. The entire day was absolutely splendid. joy is in the air. I am thoroughly inspired by the Care Beyond Skin Initiative at Tanda today. The generosity of Weiersdorf in this community and around the world is absolutely amazing and has been a complete eye-opener for me. With this happening in South Africa, I want to share a valuable quote from Udaduma Diba himself. Education is a powerful weapon which you can use to change the world.